Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Where we're going, we don't need roads. As a brick organizer for builds, this plastic bin sucked. Yeah. Mine did too. What are we going to do with them? Any idea what I could build with these? Back you go into the dead media room slash box storage closet. I probably need to eliminate a few of these boxes because I don't think I have the products that go with them anymore. I wonder if I could get Diana to watch this. Oh my god, I still have VHS tapes in the house. Ray Park was one of the actors who signed this. He's the guy who played Darth Maul. Wicket's tummy is a little upset. So whatever he expelled is now soaking up in these paper towels, which are about to be recycled. Do you feel better now? Got all the bad stuff out? Just let me know. Will you look at me while I'm talking to you? Do I need to give you a treat? Mmm, coffee. You suck! <laughs> Hope y'all were participating in this week's giveaway. It's all because of this sponsor. Go.tagjag.com slash free points. You should be using it anyway to get free gift cards. Where are you going? My head feels like it's about to explode. I have a lot of products in there. I can see that. And I used the coconut oil for the first time. And it says, no GMOs and non-hydrogenated. I hate GMOs. It's probably really hot. I think maybe that'll help my sinuses. It's clearing my pores. You don't like it. <laughs> you like it? No? <laughs> that was good leftover crazy booger. <laughs> Yeah, someone tweeted me, and I didn't even put two and two together, but that's what it means in Spanish. Loco moco. <laughs> I love using these napkins, but I hate using these napkins. Why? Because they're all decorative. Aw, yeah, I know. And then you have to throw it away. I didn't even see the other side. My brother had a little Yoda in our living room, and I used to be scared of him, and now I like him. Now he's a good person. Nice to always turn him around. <laughs> if you don't see, that's a good reason why you shouldn't judge people before you get to know them. I still don't know what I'm going to do for my sci-fi show either. Uh oh. I know I keep talking about that in the blog, but I gotta figure out something because I have to do it today. Today is the sci-fi day. And you're on a roll. And you have to make it good. Yeah. Thanks. No pressure. Uh-oh. I felt a little bit wet. <laughs> I hope she didn't pee me. She's good at taking baths. We get not so much. It's bath time. I can't tell if Pixie's shaking or my hand is. <laughs> You might be next. Look who's all nice and clean. That was fast. Was it? Did she even bathe? Should I have done it longer? No, no, no. I think you did it the right amount of time. <laughs> I think Pixie agrees. She liked it after a while. I just kind of poured warm water over her body first. I did her head last. But she it kind of... I think it was soothing. I should have put some bubbles in there. Maybe lit a candle. I'm letting the water soak in before she shakes. <laughs> okay, you want to go next? Yeah? You want to take a bath? You do? Yay! 
I don't think he knows what I'm saying. Dry yourself off, Pixie. Good job. Look at you're not wet. They're both acting weird. I think Wicket has sympathy, wetness. You don't do so well taking baths, but you'll be okay. You'll be clean in no time. Ugh, he really gave me a workout. <laughs> <laughs> he was hard. <laughs> he kept trying to jump out. Yeah, that's Wicket. And I noticed that every time I poured water, like, I tried to cover his eyes, but he'd look it. He was, like, trying to eat the water, or drink the water. Pixie didn't do that. Is this a normal dog behavior? After wrapping up the recording of my first Star Scores video, I'm heading out to meet up with another local sci-fi geek to kind of talk about possibly doing something more than what I did the first time. There are a lot of sci-fi geeks out there. Star Wars, Star Trek, Stargate, Star anything else. Battle Star Galactica. Battle Beyond the Stars. That was an old movie. I remember seeing it in the theater with Dad and a few old friends. Well, they'd be old now. We were young back in the day. The only scene I seem to remember happened to have a series of aliens standing there. One of them was eating the hot dog, and the other ones were chewing in unison as though they were enjoying the meal as well. I can't remember what I was going to tell you. Yeah, just enjoy the traffic and the falling rain. I was going to mention something along the lines of tonight being the first night in a long time, or at least the past six nights, when Diana and I were not going to be watching a Star Wars movie. We've run out. For now. I left my phone at home. This wouldn't be a huge problem, except that I'm running late and can't text him. These two nice people just bought me dinner, and I was not expecting that. On a scale from one to ten, what would you say your geek level is? Wow. Between the two of us? Between the two of us? Taking it up to 11? Oh, 11. Well, okay. 22, so. Yes, taking it to 11. Spinal Tap apparently is the only movie on IMDb that's rated out of 11 stars. My there daughter told me that last night. <laughs> I did not know I that. Now that. I'll have to look. That's definitely geeky. <laughs> you can find me online at at Sci-Fi Commons on Twitter. And could you explain what Sci-Fi Commons is? Sci-Fi Commons is, I'm really passionate about public domain, open source, uh, free culture, and everything that I do in science fiction, I want it to be for everybody. I think science fiction is so important that it's not really a business that you can keep to yourself. I want to do something and give it to people to take and, and play with it however they like. That's my thing. I love science fiction. Y'all should check them out. They just produced a series on their website, scificommons.com. I don't think I ordered this. Someone else must have from our wish list. I don't know if I can show it to you yet because it would definitely be going into next week's star scores. I'm letting Wicket try out my headband first. Looks good. He's giving me the I hate you eyes. Okay, I'll take it off. You want to start watching Doctor Who with me? Yeah. We can bond over it. I outed myself as someone who hasn't watched Doctor Who yet. I don't know, I'm kind of tired of being compared to other tech people when I've been more than just quote unquote tech for the longest time. I want to be compared to other geek people. Thanks for liking, commenting, and sharing all our videos.